but the deer, which was actually Marie's the demon in disguise, called out in Ram's voice, Lakshman, Lakshman, come and save me. When Sita heard Ram's voice, she requested Lakshman to go at once and save Ram. Lakshman consoled Sita, saying that Ram was the lord of the universe and nothing could destroy him. However, Sita was very anxious. So Lakshman told Sita not to cross the three lines that he drew around the cottage while he was away until he returned with Ram. As planned, Ravan took the opportunity to abduct Sita. He tried to cross the three lines of Lakshman, but these lines were on fire. So Ravan changed himself to a holy man and begged for arms from Sita. Sita requested him several times to come inside the cottage, but Ravan asked her to step outside instead. As Sita stepped out of her refuge, Ravan abducted her on his chariot. While Ravan was carrying Sita in his chariot, Jatayu, a big bird of the mountains, heard her cries and tried to resist Ravan with his mighty wings. After a fierce fight, Ravan cut off Jatayu's wings. As a last resort, Sita threw her jewelries along the path of the chariot so that Ram would recognize them to rescue her later. This choreography is by uh, my mother's guru, Guru Kelajir Mahapatra, and the music is by Pandit Raghunath Panigrahi. Sita Haran, taken from the Ramacharitmanasa of Tulsidas, is a chapter of the epic Ramayana which depicts how Ravana tricked and abducted Sita, Lord Rama's wife, to avenge the insult of his sister. This is a brilliant choreography of the great Odyssey maestro Padma Vibhushan. Guru Shri Kelu Chalan Mahapatra. This is set to Ragamalika and Talamalika. Music has been composed by Padma Shri Guru Raghunath Panigre. Panchavati, a happy place in the forest where Lord Rama was living with his beloved wife Sita and his brother Lakshmana. One day, Ravana had sent his brother Maharaj to the forest in the disguise of a golden deer. Maharaj started roaming around Rama's cottage and attracted Sita's attention as he intended. Spotting Maharaj, she immediately fell in love and tried to capture and keep it. But Maharaj was cunning. He would waylay her but not get into her hands. So she requested Rama, her husband, to get that golden deer for her. Rama, out of his love, went and went deep into the forest to capture that golden deer and asked Lakshmana to keep an eye on Sita so no harm can near her. Sita, being assured about the golden deer, resumed her duties. That is when she heard a cry, the cry of her husband. Lakshman, Trahi, Trahi. Lakshman, bring me your help. Hearing the scream, she ordered Lakshmana to go and help Rama. Lakshmana tried to console her, but couldn't because of her anxiety. So he drew three lines around the hut and asked Sita, not to cross them, whatever may happen. And he went into the forest. That is when the wicked Ravana entered the Panchavati.